Okay guys, let's get into the top 10 Cedar Point roller coasters. Wicked Twister was really fun. To me it felt just like V2 Vertical Velocity because it is. It just felt a little faster and a little more intense. Really fun ride, but not as good as many of the other roller coasters at Cedar Point. For me, Gemini was really smooth. Um, I don't know if it's always really smooth or I got a lucky ride. It was also a fun coaster overall. And I was really lucky and, and it actually raced. So it was a really fun ride and that's why it's here at number nine. Raptor was a really fun ride, but for me, I didn't like it as much as many people have said. Personally, this was one of the lower rides in Cedar Park compared to the vast BNL, but it was still a good, enjoyable, and very intense ride. Gatekeeper is a really fun ride. It's in number seven because it's not as good as the other coasters at this park. It is, however, better than many, a few of the other wing coasters. It's better than X Flight, um, but I did only get one ride. So for now, it stays in number seven. Foul Raven is the only dive coaster I've ridden, and it is really fun. I really enjoyed the ride, but it just wasn't as fast as I was expecting, or as, ten or as intense as I wanted. Anyway, so that's why it places in number six. Oh my gosh, this ride was so much fun. I enjoyed Magnum so much. Um, it was late at night, so it was a night ride. And just the, the fun factor of it being a night ride combined with the crazy air, air time and just like 200 feet. Like it's a fun, it's a fun, enjoyable ride. And that's why it's placing in number five. Okay, next we've got Millennium Force. There is so much to talk about. The the length, the intensity. I mean, look at me with my drab haircut. I don't even know what drab means, but I mean, probably fits the description of a really stupid haircut. Anyway, really long, intense, fun layout. Great coaster. I did gray out like most coaster thesis because it is so intense and so amazing. That is number four. Okay, in number three, we've got Maverick. Maverick is one of the best coasters I've ever ridden. It's kind of hard to describe it. It's just so amazing. It's so confusing and uh, you make a turn this way, make a turn that way, make an inversion, make another inversion. Uh, that middle launch is great. Um, it, it's just a really unique, uh, fun, crazy, intense, all of the words that you would describe any amazing coaster, all jammed into one kind of small, low to the ground like okay now we've got number two one of my favorite coasters literally ever it is so intense more intense than max force more intense than like all of the coasters i've ridden and, and the ride's so much fun being so high in the air um you can see like a hundred miles in every direction honestly one of my favorite coasters ever that's why it's number two at cp Okay, now on to the obvious number one. Steel Vengeance is literally so much fun. It's obviously my number one coaster. I mean, how can it not be? All the inversions are amazing. Some of the, if some of the, if not the best airtime I have ever gotten in my life. Like, the best ejector airtime you're ever gonna receive. Like, this is easily my favorite coaster. And my whole visit to Cedar Point was so much fun. Thank you guys for watching my top 10 roller coasters at CP. I don't know, I just did that. <laughs> I'm Okay, we'll we'll just go back to re restart. Okay. <laughs> top 10 roller coasters at Cedar Point.